I want to ask you a question. Would you attend an anime convention in the nation's capital or in any other major city with homeless encampments, tent encampments near the convention center? That is very, that is very close distance, very close walking distance to the convention center and is occupying some of the smallest uh, fair, fair, uh, parks near a church? Would you attend an anime convention that has this problem? Where the city doesn't give, give a damn? That's the topic I want to discuss in this video. For those who don't know me, I'm J Kid from the Ministry for Taku, 13 slash 14 year anime convention veteran, and I want to talk about Oricon 2022, the convention that had that has this, that the last known convention for the convention was in 2019, before the lockdowns happened in 2020, and for 2021 they have. A pretty much dystopian and bleak version of what an anime convention is like. In 2022, it's still going to be the same thing, but it's much worse due to due to a self-imposed vaccine mandate and mask mandate. While almost everything else in Washington D.C. is back to normal, but there is one major issue: it's the tent encampments. During March, during after the lockdowns and during the lockdowns of March 2020, which lasted for a whole year, tent encampments started popping up all around Washington D.C. Some in Chinatown, some in Union Station, and some near the convention center. Washington D.C. did not have this problem before the uh, lockdowns, and suddenly it's acceptable. Now San Francisco ha had tent cities, but now they're all spread out. Same thing in Los Angeles, same thing in Seattle, and same thing in Portland. I mean, once you say has tent cities, they're screwed unless they're willing to actually ad address the root problem who calls why their tent stays there? Why their tent encampments? In all, in all, country 2021, there was tent encampments close to the convention center, occupying one of the uh, of the outdoor photo shoot areas. And I got uh, intel from these people saying that they saying that do these tent encampments. They're not going back to Oricon 2021. They're not. I mean, they're not going back to Oricon after what they, what they saw in 2021. And 2022 is worse. Those, those tent encampments have grown. And they're still occupying the uh, church. Now, when Oricon was in Baltimore, we didn't have this problem. Of course, they were homeless in the streets. But they were, they were either arm's length, or in reality, street's length away from us, from the uh, main convention hallway, from, from the main convention venue. They either have their small encampments or sleeping areas near the federal courthouse in, uh, in Baltimore, or in out way areas where tourists won't uh, notice them. Of course, there are some homeless, that, homeless people that are begging for change, but it was a very minor issue. And none of these encampments will locate in outdoor uh, cosplay areas. Now, Oricon and what moved to Washington, D.C., and there was no encampments in 2017, 2018, and 2019. It's 2021. And these encampments are there. And they're there in 2022. 
Now it begs the question, why would anyone attend an anime convention that has these tent encampments, that is in very close distance away from the venue and occupying the cosplay photo shoot areas? The outdoor cosplay photo shoot areas. Is it worth paying $100 to wear a face covering 14 hours a day, show proof of facts? For this, it's terrible. It's terrible. It's not an anime convention. It's more like a... It's less than an anime convention. If, if, it's, if it's what I saw in 2021... And I, I, seriously, in 2021, I knew it's going to be worse. In 2022, it's just going to be more worse. It's going to be more the same. Uh, 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 why should I attend a convention that that's in a city that has no will that has no that has no real interest in solving the problem? A city government that doesn't care about tent cities and will enable them. And if a tent city is in federal poverty, like that church that has a small park, they're not going to do anything about it. Nothing. It's the federal government's problem, and where it looks like the federal government but it clearly doesn't care. I, I will go to an anime convention near... I will I will go to an anime co convention, convention that is close to normal as possible. Where at least they don't tolerate tent cities. And if they are tent cities, they are away from the tourist areas. These tent cities? These tent encampments in Washington, D.C.? They're in tourist spots now. And people wondering why most tourists are avoiding Washington, D.C. Washington, D.C. is my birth city. And since these lockdowns, it has gone to shit. And apparently most people don't care anymore. But I know one thing. I have no interest in spending my money in a city that refuses to go back to normal. This is JK from the Ministry of Taku speaking. Have a good day.